Hey guys, so today I want to show you a haul. I've hauled a bunch of things for Camille's birthday party coming up in December. Um, most of these were purchased at the Dollar Tree or I got them at Hobby Lobby on Black Friday. And I pretty much got everything for some of the decor and the goodie bags for the guests as well as the kids. I want to share with you like the before, before I even um, put it all together because I would hate myself if I didn't show the before before I put everything together. This is just some decor things. Her initials, KJ. These are cardboard letters and I got pink and purple paint because I want to do like an ombre DIY with these. They'd be really cute. They stand up. Here I got some pink glitter letters I want to make for her poster board. Here is some tissue centerpieces. They're only a dollar each. I think we're only having two tables so that's perfect. And this is some tassel. I think I'm going to put this on her poster board or on a table. This is a number four cake topper in gold. I thought that was adorable. And then I found these. I found these at Michael's, I think, actually. And I think this would be cute just maybe put on here. Like, just glue down. Then on to the party favors. So we have three younger kids. So I wanted to give them something like a favor bag so when they get bored or if they are not entertained they can play with them so three boys so i got each one a book these emoji balls that are nice and soft and toy cars and they're big enough so they're not like a choking hazard or anything but i thought that was cool i also got some bath toys and i'll be putting them in these bags i got a bunch of these bags they're like these gift bags here or favor bags that I got from Hobby Lobby for super cheap Black Friday. I love these colors. So these are the party favors for the guests. Most are couples. So I thought the guys really don't care for party favors. So I got it for the girls, for the girlfriends. So I got these bath bombs. I really wanted bath bombs. And I found these because they're kind of like unicorn rainbow themed. So I got two different colors. These were... $6.99 each for seven at Marshall's and then I got these at Dollar Tree so these are these bath sets and I thought I put one in each so I need seven total so I got three and then these came with four each and I thought they're just the prettiest colors kind of goes with the whole bath spa theme so I thought that'd be cute I already have these bags that I'm going to put them in I found these tags at Marshall's today and I thought they'd be so cute. I'll just be changing out the ribbon. I got this pink kind of iridescent ribbon for just a dollar. Dollar Tree. So all of that. Just wanted to show the before before I put them all together. Here is an example of the cake I just ordered for her. So it's going to look like this. But she's going to have pink and purple flowers. It's going to be a sheet cake because we have like 20 people. It's going to see happy birthday in purple and Camille in pink. Happy fourth birthday in purple. And yeah, it's also going to be gold.
guys, so I'm back on my laptop doing more DIYs for Camille's party. These are a bunch of photos I simply got from my phone. What I did is I uploaded it to my drive, uploaded to my Google Drive, downloaded it, put it into iPhoto. I put it into iPhoto because you can do like a contact sheet like this and print it per sheet or there's different sizes on how big you want the photos makes it really easy and I got her printer to work so I'm going to print these off and put this on her poster board. So before I go and print it I want them to look cohesive so I'm going to just use like one of these generic filters to make it really easy for me. I'm going to use this instant filter. I like it because it looks a little pinkish which goes with her theme and then I can also go ahead and change things like the shadows or just make it more Kind of pop a little bit more with some contrast. We should do this like a full on tutorial of this, but I'm really just trying to get this done. Hey guys, this is my DIY outfit. So we're working on this. I printed Camille's photos. They turn out really nice, kind of vintagey looking. And I got the paint here. I have some cardstock. I've already had this. This is the perfect time to use it. Her glittery letters, all her things. I put the party favors in this crate or bin that we got from um, Goodwill a long time ago. I'm going to reuse it because it's perfect. Um, this is the poster board. It's just a standard size. I want to show you before I get started. I don't have much of a plan. I'm just going to start and see how it goes. putting her name I was thinking of putting Camille's magical birthday or something but it seemed like it would take up too much room so I think I put Camille Jordan which is her middle name a little more detail I have this ribbon here and what I did is I put it here I'm gonna just tape it and have it as if it's like holding the photos the photos are on the string and at the end I'm gonna curl the ribbon just do a little ribbon curl so it kind of looks like really cute and has some detail to it you do that on both sides and put some pictures at the bottom We are going to do her letters these are just cardboard block letters and we have two paints here my goal is to make it look like a pink and purple ombre we'll see it's her DIYs however she wants to do it but that is the goal are you ready to paint mm -hmm. we're gonna change your shirt so you don't get paint on that shirt okay are you ready to paint So what we did is we put a piece of tape to separate the colors and then we're going to kind of blend it in the middle. We'll see how that works. Are you having fun? Mm -hmm. Let's spread it around, okay? Can you put the pink on the side? Mm-hmm. Very good. I do it on the edge. Nice and edge, yeah. Got some pink here. We're also gonna go on the side. Hey, I did do this side. Can I put it on this side now? Mm -hmm. Do the top first and then you can go on the side, okay? That good? Mm hmm. On the line or not? No, not by the line. 
Wait, that way? Yep. I done. Good job. So I found these thank you cards that I had in my stationery set. I think it's the perfect color combo. Very pretty. I'm just going to write a little thank you for them coming to Kino's party and also just stick this in there. 